Grace was in the scene. Don't worry about her, she's my friend. But it's no more you see, man. Grace is going to be a big problem to us all. What do we do? Let's put our eyes on her for the meantime. Maybe she's up to something. Yes, maybe she's up to something different. Dear, you need to do your best to ensure that this is not announced publicly to everyone. Understand? Understand? Oh, all right, I will. Thank you. Can I go now? Very well. Judith, what are you up to? What were you doing to that little girl? I don't get you. Stop talking as if you have no knowledge of what I'm saying. What were you doing to that little student? You and that so-called Tony. Grace, do not insult me. I won't take it from you. You're still pretending. Let me tell it to your face. Let me ask you. Are you a blood-sucking demon? Yes. Now let me tell you. If you tell me the truth, it will set you free. But if you decide to keep lying, <laughs> I will expose you and that so-called Tony. Respect. They say is reciprocal. Respect yourself or I, or I will I... report you to the school authority. Rubbish. Blood sucking demon. Are you a blood sucking demon? Tony. To your class. To your class. I have lectures with your class in few minutes. And you, listen. If you do not mind your business in this school, the shame will be yours. Trust me.
So, uh, our last class on the figures of speech, we handled hyperbole, we handled oxymoron, and can someone else tell me one figure of speech we handled? Yes? Similarly. Good, clap for her. Good. So today, this is the figure of speech we are going to have today. Who can pronounce this? Can someone pronounce it? I'm sure you're familiar with this. You must have come across this in your SS1 class. Oh, yes, you. Um, onomatopia. Wrong, sit down. Onomatopia. Onomatopia. Sit down. Okay, so what does this mean? Alright, yes. Thank you. Using words that indicate the sound it donates. Repeat that again so all of them can hear. Using words to indicate the sound someone donates. Alright, thank you. Alright, thank you. Using words to indicate the sound someone donates. Sit down, please. Thank you. Clap for him. That's what, I'll make it very easier for you. In my own words, I would say it is when the sound suggests the meaning of what you're saying. You know? Like when you say the mewing of a cat, bleating of a goat, the sound of what you're saying actually gives you an example of what you're talking about. Do you understand? Put it down. So, onomatopoeia is when the sound suggests the meaning. So our next uh, figure of speech for today Just like a child denied of her mother's breast. When did you meet her that you can't forget about her? My friend, you need to focus on your studies. Can I ask you? Go ahead. Have you ever been in love before? Yes, but with the wrong person. That is why I am telling you to focus on yourself. You need to forget about her and focus on your studies. Is it bad to love? It is not. But right now, what is important is your studies. Okay? Can I love again if I should forget about her? You will. But this is the time for school. This is the time for you to focus on your studies, like I said. Okay? Come, let me buy you lunch, okay? Don't even ask me that question. Since this madam decided to make me her business, every day she's busy spoiling her name, thinking it's my own name that she's spoiling. Judy, see how you, your conscience is tormenting you. You will soon expose yourself with this attitude of yours. You will soon expose yourself. Expose what to the school authorities if I may ask Grace. Ask her! Ask her! Judith, um, look at me that I'm trying to cover you, for, cover up for you. You are here displaying yourself. I just pity you. I'm, I'm listening. Grace, the both of you have to stop this nonsense. You have to stop this mess for goodness sakes. Just take a look. Eh? 
Take a look the way the whole students are looking at us. Let the students look at us, oh. Let them look. I don't care. Since this auntie decided to make me her subject matter, I will not let her rest in this school. Let them look. What is wrong with you? Judith, you are mad. You are mad. You are the mad one. You are very stupid. You are the mad one. You are the mad one. What's your problem? You are mad. You are madder than mad. You are mad. You are mad. What's your problem? Hey, 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 hey. How can you get me? Judith, you are in dress again. You are not ashamed. I have heard so much about you in this school. In fact, I don't need any explanations. Both of you should see me in the office right away. Better. Okay, sir. Yes, sir. sir, sir please let me carry my phone. My office, I said, not there. Sir, I, I, she was the one, no? I'm coming to you, sir. Don't look at you now. You see a shouting. You will not have a place. No, 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 My dear, people can lie with full confidence and plenty of joy. Hi! Grace, and the principal will believe everything just like that. Why won't he? My dear, if you see the confidence in them, <laughs> people have lost their conscience. My problem is that student that stood by her. They are even the ones that, that pointed accusing fingers at me. And she went ahead and said that I intruded in her in her lectures. <laughs> Matthew is not funny. Uh, I would if, if we do not expose her, my dear, so many students' lives will be in danger. That girl is evil. Honestly, you are very correct. But you know what you do, eh? You need to be very careful of her. We all need to be careful. Yeah. Meanwhile, the lecture I told you I wanted to take. It's already 30 minutes away. Oh. I need to rush. My dear, I want to be here. I want to concentrate on myself. I'll be with you. Eh? Let me just finish. No problem. Hey! What do you want me to do? Don't tell me you don't know what to do to that good for nothing boy. That guy is on my head. He attacks me wherever he sees me, as if that is not enough. He goes about telling people that I, Tony, am a blood-sucking demon. Ma, we really have to do something about this. If that is the case, then I will have my eyes on him. But you know the school authority is watching us, so we have to be very careful. We have to be careful. Not be easy. 
how the principal is not somewhere listening. <laughs> so I really think we'll get them a gift. What do you guys think? Well, it's a nice idea. But if I'm to ask, how much are we to contribute in order to afford the kind of gift we have in mind? Nice question from there. Um, I think 5K will go. Yeah, support that. Let's go on 5K. 5K is okay. What's up, Grace? You're not saying anything. Please, Matthew, don't call my name. I am not interested in whatever contribution you are doing. Why? Yeah, 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 Matthew, that's fine. She's not, she's not interested. She's not interested now. Let's go ahead. So, like we were saying, 5K. Um, 5K contribution for. Do this. Please, please do not provoke me. Please, I, I, I wasn't talking to you. If I provoke you, what will you do? I will beat you up like a child. You cannot. You are not born. Ah. This is not my idea for calling this meeting. Ah, why would you be like this? Matthew, I remember telling you that I did not want to get involved in anything that was just this. Go punish you. I am not my name. Zach, shut up. Go punish you. I am saying this. You will be my cousin by then. Excuse me. Please. It's high time the school authority knows who you are. What do you have to say? Nothing. School authority knows. What, what, what is this one saying? It's like this girl is running mad. Don't you all know me? Am I not Judith? Is there anything else that you're supposed to know if she's not interested in the meeting? Let her get out. and comport yourselves. Listen, we are all here to serve our country life, okay? And anyone amongst you who thinks he or she is not interested in this should back off and stop abusing each other here. Like that, go, 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 Honestly like speaking, I, I, I dislike the idea of we quarreling and putting chaos amongst us. I don't like it at all. After entering ourselves for this 11 months, is it now we come and be having a kind of nonsense vision now? Please, are we going to come up with the yes talk or are we not coming up with it? If it's about the quarreling. We are still contributing the money. Eh, let's talk yes. about the money. Let's continue the money. Yeah. Grace, can I have a word with you? I hope it has nothing to do with that cheap liar. Grace, don't be left out. Don't be left out in what? I am not interested in whatsoever you guys are doing. I am not interested. Then do what others are doing. And I am not interested like I said. What is your problem? Anyway, I was going somewhere before you stopped me. So can I? It's okay. Just do well and think about it. You think about it and get out of my way. <laughs> your major reason for coming to this school is to chase women. Henceforth, let this be the very last time an issue like this will arise or come to me. You all are still in secondary school and very mature. I expect that you respect yourselves. I get it all wrong. If anyone is to be there, then you should be the one not me. Shut up! Shut up! Abigail, have you seen what you have caused? Have you seen the way you have created issues and problems between these two young men? Have you seen it? As you can see, Ma, I'm not having any problem with anybody. They choose to fight themselves. And that fight will stop from now. Ma, Ken and his friends beat me up all because of 
his selfish interest towards our people. Hey, 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 Tony, watch your mouth. Don't insult me. Then, if you are aware of me, you are. I believe you should keep quiet. You should know me too well. I'm not afraid of anyone. You should trust a copper, not a staff. You should not have every right to talk. Oh, really? Yes. I can see that you are the one behind all this trouble. That is it, right? <laughs> Slap him! Yes, give it to him more. I can see he's very selfish and self-centered. Give it to him! I will have my eyes on you henceforth in this school. It's all right. Fine. You have done your worst. But no matter what, she still remember my care. What's going on here? What's going on? Judith! What, what, what sort of stupid question is that? What do you think I was doing with her? Huh? Hey, hey, hey. Don't go out there and start saying things you know nothing about. Else I won't take it lightly with you. Leave my office. Inside the office. Yes, yes, yes. Something. Continue. No, no, feel free. Continue. Matthew. So at this age, you still gossip. I knew you were up to something. Yeah. It's fine. Don't worry. I will show you. Tell me this quarrel is still persisting. After I took time out to reconcile all of you in this place, in this office, what happened again? Sides Grace, she goes about saying unprintable things about me. It's just that I'm not a troublemaker. If not, I would have taken this matter to the police. No, 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 no. It hasn't gotten to that stage now. Hi. One thing I don't understand. Okay, don't worry, don't worry. One thing I find difficult to understand is why some people take delight in creating problems for others. This school has come a long way. Okay, don't bother yourself, okay? Just relax. I think I'll have to hold a meeting with all the coppers so we can talk to ourselves and probably put a final nail on this coffin. Okay, sir. Okay. All right. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hey! 
you should stop that rubbish you're doing there. Are you people stupid? Stop there! treating these students like this? Mr. Kaffa, these people are the biggest fool we have in this school. Yes! We they are the biggest fools. Point of correction, we don't train fools in this school. Mr. Kaffa, did you ask them what they did before I asked them to do that? Why should I ask you when you are maltreating them before me? Hey, 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 Mr. Kaffa, I'm a teacher in this school. If you think you can teach, I can teach! See, go to Amadi Bello University, ask off, Kopatunde, I know a gentleman. Don't allow me to lose my temper on you. Don't allow me to lose my temper on you. What's your is it that every, what, what are we suffering in this school? Eh? Is it you that will suffer in this school again? After hearing about blood sucking, blood sucking, blood sucking. Are you the one that this school is suffering for the gate? Oh, I'm two of you, both of you. Now get to your class. Come on, get to your class. Don't worry. I'll get to you. Huh? Look at them. I'm talking to you. I said, move to your class. Stop it. I don't want this to happen next time, please. Don't allow me to lose my... Move don't allow me to lose my temper on you. Don't allow me to lose my temper on you. I am Mr. Kaffa. Go to Amadi Bello University and ask of you. I'm not a child's man. That they prostrated me in this school. You have done me issue. to watch Copa Judith very closely. Find out her activities with students in this school and make sure she does not know that you're after her. Uma, why would I be suspecting her? Just do the assignments I asked you to do, okay? Okay, ma. Be very careful. Yes, ma. Be very careful. What did I say? Be very careful. Now go. Go, 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 go. go. Thank you, ma. That's okay. I had a class with them. Okay. I want you to do something for me. I want you to be a watchdog to that lady that calls herself Grace, that stupid lady. Okay? okay. Follow her step by step very closely. Listen to all her conversations with people and feed me back. you is for your own good and nothing else. Okay. What is it about? It's about Abigail. Abigail? What about her? Look, you need to forget her and move on with your life. <laughs> I, I don't understand. It's Abigail we are talking about here. Come on. She's the girl of my life. Whom I found happiness. Stop telling me this. You have to stop all this. You have to stop this whole this whole talk. Look, the people you are fighting, they are not ordinary. I am telling you this because of your own life, because of your sake. You need to leave this girl and move on with your life, Ken. Please. No, I can't. It's not possible for me. Okay. You know that. Think about it. Just think about it, please. I 
know you all will be wondering why I called for this meeting. Um, honestly, I asked myself what could that be. Yeah, me too. Um, I say enough is enough to the happiness in this school. You mean the missing student? Yes. And hey, Bruce, just go straight to the point. I know the brains behind this happenings. I'm crazy with a second, okay? Let's get what goes to it. What are you using with I mean, what are you saying in essence? Wait, your grace. You mean all these things have been happening here in this school? How are you sure about this, Grace? Like I said, I know the people involved. And it's no other than our co copper Judith and one of the students, Tony, are the brains behind the killings in the school. Absolutely Judith. unbelievable. So, Grace, do you know the implication of what you just said? There are no implications because I know them and they know I know them. We have to report this to the school authority because they are about to do something unimaginable and we cannot stop them if we don't stop them now. This is absolutely unbelievable. This is not about absolutely unbelievable. I'm telling you what is happening now. No, the principal must see this. Please do. You sure, Mr. We have to do something to rescue this. I'm telling you. I'm going straight to the principal office now. We have to report this now. Now. The principal must see this. I'm going to report this. Please, we have to. No wonder. Hi, Shabba. Wait until she come and bite you. What is it, Judith? There's a very big problem as I speak to you right now. Problem? Yes. What, what happened? Chris just exposed you. Chris just exposed your identity. Exposed? Exposed me how? That you and Tony are the brain behind all the misses to death in this school. Chris did that? No. Um, um, how did you get to know? She called us for a meeting, and she has planned to report you to the school authority. No, 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 she cannot do that. She can't dare do that. No. She... See, now, nah, listen, listen to me, Judith. There's no, there's no time for this, okay? There's no time for this. Now, nah, you, you, you have to think of what to do now before the school authority not get to know about this. Okay. See, I'm leaving. Um, I'll see you later, okay? Okay. People now hold meetings to discuss me, right? Shut up and stop shouting at me, demon. That's what you all now call me. Is that it? Is that not what you are? Oh, oh, you think we don't know you and Tony's movement in this school? And our students have been missing here and there. You think we don't know? You think we don't know? Now that's an insult. That is an insult and I will not take it from you or any other person. I'm going to bring in the police. <laughs> that would be better. Demon copper. You think I'm joking? Yeah, I will rob the police in. You will hear from me, don't worry. You, you think you can eat me up? My blood is bitter. I'm here to study. You're here to study. That's very interesting. So why are you deviating from your studies? I don't understand you, ma'am. You do not understand me. Ken and Tony, who are they to you? Both are my friends. Both are your friends? You're not telling me the truth. Who are they to you? They're just my classmates. That classmates? Do you realize that these two boys are fighting because of you? Do you realize that? And by the way, what are you doing with Tony? That one that doesn't want to make any good, any useful thing with his life. My darling, Ken is a better man for you. He will want to see you grow. Do you get me? But we... No buts. Go and think about it. Do that.
So this is true, ma. That you are the brain behind all that is happening in this school. What are you talking about? Meaning that your identity has been exposed. Yes. Including Topsy, Tony and others. Yes. yes. Ken. Yes. You dare talk to me like that? Yes. 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 Do it again. Because you deserve it. Very well. And this is just the beginning. Ah. Tell her. Blood sucker. It is your mother that is a blood sucker. Are you mad? Is it because we've been keeping quiet all this while? You are the blood sucker. What what? what, 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 what? Why are you doing? Why are you chasing my copper like a common thing? Are you crazy? I don't have you got love? We are not. But you have respect? We are not. She's a blood Yes. Yes. She's a Yes. I want to treat her like one. Slap me, yes, sir. That's why I came straight to report to you before they come behind and tell you another story. That's a serious. 
It's okay. I'll call Ken to order. All right. Hmm? All right, sir. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. Does it mean that none of you knows anything about Copa Judith? How do you know? And besides, we didn't attend the same school. We only met here as Copas. Oh, yes. That lady is demonic. As pretty as she is. The, forget about the pretty. The pretty ones does the evil thing, if you don't know. Um, please, I'm really sorry. I have class to attend to. We don't mind. It's okay. Are the same. They are all the same. Uh, I have some mathematics lecture. Thank you. Be at all. Why, what's bothering you? Is it, 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 it not that you're called Linda? She has been frequenting my class, threatening my classmates. What could be the reason behind her pulling such stunts? I don't know. I wonder because it, it still baffles me. I have told her severally to stop it, but she wouldn't listen. As in, you're saying that you've confronted her and she's not doing anything about it? I have severally. Severally, please, help me warn her because if she doesn't stop, I will, I will, I will, make, I will do something that it will not be, no longer be between who we are. The school authority will even come into it and, and, and I know what's going on. It's okay. Um, I think I'll have to meet her and talk to her. For the fact that the vampires have exposed themselves in this school, it's not elastic for us to still expose ourselves and let everybody know who we are. I applaud you for your confiding in me, okay? Don't worry, I'll talk to her whenever I see her. I'll make sure we come to the end of this, alright? Please do. Because the next time, I won't take it lightly with her. Thank you. Bye bye. Tell me the truth. Are you involved in what is going on in this school? Because all the fingers are pointing at you. And who are they? Your fellow coppers, of course. Grace, Matthew, and the rest of them. So I want you to tell me the truth. Because if we find out that you're involved, you will hate yourself. being calm right now because of your position as the vice principal of the school. Ordinarily, I would have fallen out with you. This is an insult. Excuse me. Don't worry. Don't worry. Matthew, I am surprised at you. How do you go about telling people that I'm a lesbian? Point of correction. I was not accusing you, I only asked. Listen to yourself. You only asked. See, let me tell you. Let this be the very last time you go about telling people that I'm a lesbian because if you do it again, I will take it up with you My and friend. you will regret it. Are you threatening me? No, I am not threatening you. 
It is a promise of what I will do to you if you do not shut up. Listen, let me tell you. You don't go about insulting me because the two of us get along. Or your conscience is blaming you, is it not? Look, I'm only trying to advise you that this lesbianism of a thing doesn't fit a lady of your type. You How dare you? How dare you? Eh? How dare you dish out advice or instructions to me? As who? My husband? My, my father or my mother? How dare you? You dare slap me? Judith, you will regret this. Honestly, you will explain yourself. But for now, let me tell you, the war is between you and I. Catch you. Do you think you intimidate me? I cannot be intimidated, whether by your size or because you're a man. I cannot be intimidated. Listen, if you know what is good for you, stay away from me. Stay away. You think I have time? I don't even have time to exchange words with you. Judith, I'll Brother, come for you. I'll come, come for you. you. Don't worry. Fool. Just They're imagine. You dare raise your hand on me. And after now, the, 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 the principal will be supporting you. Oh! I still remain your senior here. And I don't care whether when you school premises or not. Let this be the last time you try this nonsense. Look at you. All glitching puzzles. You, you dare call me by my nomenclature? Yes. Oh, so yes, I did. I just called you. And what will you do? What will I do? invited you here. <laughs> I don't need anybody to invite you. Remember we are running for our dear lives. So we take a different direction. I've come to take that that belongs to me. are missing in this school. Some students are transforming into beasts and animals, wolves. Uh, and you sit down here. Now here be my position, so I don't know how the thing they use happen. Will you keep quiet? Oh, we employ the Thomas sit in the, at the gate here. Oh, what do you mean by surveillance? Is surveillance no longer a part of security watch? You, are, you, you don't know that we are supposed to go from class to class all around the building checking if there is any security threat? How will he know what is going on in this school when all he does is sleep at the security post? But am I this they support me? Oh. Will, will you shut up, my friend? Eh? Eh? We are losing so students in this school. You are sitting down here and you are, you are saying you want to support me. If I see them, I'm going to do my own life. Will you keep quiet? Now, listen to me. Listen and sing good. What do we pay you for? From now, you hear me? Go from class to class. You will go around all these old buildings. You will put 
the security men all around. I want those students that are transforming into beasts and causing trouble in this school. Killing students. Come, does it even not occur to you that as a security man, this type of thing is happening in the country that you're supposed to have to stop the people that don't do their job? Sorry. They're not moved. Sorry, sir. Sorry. 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 It will not go ever happen again. Of course, it does. It will not go happen again. You will lose your job. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. What has come over you girls? Why will you go about disgracing and embarrassing yourselves in these two premises? Linda! Bisi! One her. Talk to her because she's the cause of all this problem. Tell her to stay up in the track. I have to turn it in that class and I must achieve it. Not when I'm there. Not when I'm in that class. Listen, even if you have a target or you want to do anything, you must come through. How dare you? Who are you to seek for permission before I do what I want to do? Who are you? In case you have forgotten, I am who I am. Enough of all this nonsense. If she doesn't want, I will come to your class and scatter everywhere. Will you shut up? Shut up and keep quiet. Oh, have you forgotten that I'm also a member of that class? You want to attack my class? <laughs> Listen, I have to warn both of you for the very last time. If you've decided and agreed to be disgraced and exposing yourself, you both should never get me involved in all this nonsense. Ah, what is it? for giving that girl such a, 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 a position. That's why she cannot rub shoulder with me. If I'm talking, she's talking. She don't have fear anymore. If I may ask you, you what, what are you looking for in that class? I have to target then and I'm not accomplish it now. But still be while we are in the school. Why don't wait till we we'll get back to the hostel? Then you can achieve whatever plan you have. Well, I'm in the class that you come and make. Huh? happening to this school is from this school. Are you in any way accusing anybody? I'm not accusing anybody, but I'm suspecting that the foundation of this school is faulty. It's not clean. Absolutely unbelievable. Are you accusing the people that built this school, the government or the school authority? But, but stop acting as if you are a kid or you don't know what is happening. How can you tell me that Students keep disappearing every day, turning to animals before our very eyes. And nothing is happening. Nobody's doing anything. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. How can you say that nothing is happening? The principal is seriously on this. And even with the teachers, we on it. And I believe that we are going to get the solution. Principal is doing something. How many weeks now? What is the solution? What is the outcome of what is the no result? See, let me tell you. We will be here one day. The parents of those uh, dead, dead children will come here with uh, the law enforcement agent and bundle all of us. Now, every Friday we are, we are going to call. I, we put up a resolution, he refused to grant it. So, now, what do we do? You are here. One day I will just leave you. You want to do that? We are trying our best and we must get to it. We must get a solution. Just don't tell me that you are just afraid. No problem. You shouldn't be afraid of all this. If you say so. We'll get to the solution. No problem. I believe you. I believe you. Barnabas the Barnabas. <laughs> no problem. Uh, when that shall never end. Imagine a copper killing students and yet pretend like nothing happened. My dear Mary, this whole thing surprises me. And I think this has been her lifetime. And nobody has come to notice it. God. Of course. Of course. Assistance. The principal is. 
is working towards it. She cannot go scot free. But let me tell you. Judith, my rating of you is very high. You are a wonderful teacher. In fact, the management is contemplating retaining you in this school as a family teacher at the end of your service. Thank you. How about that? Thank you very much, sir. Thank you, I appreciate it. But I will ask for a little time to think about it, then I'll get back to you. Well, you have all the time. You have all the time to think about it. But please do accept our request. We are so impressed. Since you came, the performance of the students has improved. And this should be a sign of seriousness with their studies. We are so impressed. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Just like I said, I'll need a little time. But, sir, I have a very minor problem. Um, I don't know what it is with Grace and Matthew, the other coppers. They've been a problem to me in the school. I was wondering, would it be possible for you to have a word with them? Judith, Matthew and Grace are your fellow coppers. So it's also possible that they're even jealous of you. Jealous? That's what I think. Jealous? Yes, that's what I think. <laughs> what about that? Uh, <laughs> even for the fact that I respect you so much, believe me, I would have fallen out with them a long time ago. Oh, no, 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 for that. Like I said, just mind your own business. Don't listen to them. They may just, 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 they are not comfortable with your performances. And they will be rating you. And I think that is what is the cause of the problem. So, but don't worry, I will put my eyes down and make sure that you are not persecuted. Okay, sir. Thank Excellent. you very much. Yes. I appreciate it. Thank you for yourself. And Grace and Adam, why will Judith associate herself with such devilish group that sucks blood? Ah, my dear, I am just disappointed in her. Do you know the annoying thing? <laughs> that girl is a big fat liar. In fact, she can lie for the continent, for Africa. See, I suggest we should report her to the police. I agree with you. Before she will do the worst. She doesn't know what she's doing to herself. By the time the principal is done with her, she will regret ever being posted to the school. I promise her that. I beg, forget that one, Barnabas. Forget it. Who knows if the principal has something to do with her? No, no, no. I won't take that from you. The principal I know can never try such rubbish. See, forget Mr. Barnabas. No man is an island with the look on the principal's face. See, if the school authority is not careful, he will bring shame upon the school. No, no. The principal can never try such. I have been here in this school for some years now. And I know the man I'm talking about. You have spent some years, have you spent some time in, with him in his bedroom? Yeah. Do you know if they do it in, their, or in his office? Ask huh? him. If they do that, uh, uh, ask him. By the way, that's not what we are discussing here. We are actually talking about Judith here. Mr. Banalbas, just speak for yourself. I'm even afraid of that girl. She's devilish. I'm telling you. Sucking demon. See, all these things that we're saying here, we should be important things.
that you could conspire and carry out a protest in my school without my knowledge. Mr. Barnabas, by the way, who authorized this protest? So, it is true that Judith is the one behind all that has been happening in the school. Yes. Sir. Barnabas, do you have any proof of this? What? You saw with our eyes. Sir, they lose everywhere. This is absolutely unbelievable. Yes, sir, I can attest to it, sir. I want you to submit your assignments tomorrow. Work together as one. Well. We are all one. If you don't know anything, you ask your fellow student. I don't know this one. Teach me. You teach each other. That's why we are all one another, right? Yes, yeah. yeah. So I hope I'm, I'm understood. Yes, yeah. Auntie. So that is what um I'm not ready for that crap. I'm gonna see you right now. Hey. Right now. Hey. <laughs> Please. Like I said, I am talking to this. And if I don't go with you, what will happen? What will happen? Yes. Like you don't know what will happen. <laughs> you don't know? Please excuse me. So students, I want you. I need to see you. Huh? Hey. hey. I'm sorry, it's okay now. What is the name? The meaning of this is that you must follow me right now. We have to talk. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! All of you. Yes? We're not going anywhere. Oh, really? Yes. We're not going anywhere. school authority is watching us. So ma, what do we do now? Like I just said, lie low. I don't want any student to be attacked by any one of us. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
the school compound. I don't know who is responsible for the death of a student. That's not true. Tony, tell me, what is going on? Ma, I don't really know. Summon everyone. I need to speak with all of you. You all must be out of your minds. Go! That's okay. Now, I want all of you to tell me who is responsible for what happened to the student lying dead. I'm talking to all of you. Who is responsible? Where's Lucy? She went home. That's a lie. Big fat lie. You all will fish her out as soon as possible. I need her to explain to me what happened to the girl. Out! Where are you? You need to come over and witness what is going on. Judith has finally manifested. Yes. You told me and I believed it too. Honestly. Just try and come, eh? Try and come. As you can all see, it's revision. I'm basically not going to teach anything, but we'll refresh our memory on what we have learned from the beginning of the term till date. The exams are around uh, the corner. Judith, you have to stop this lecture now. Um, sir, I hope all is well. Don't ask me any question. Just come to me. circumstances in my school and you expect me to fold my hands? Sir, I am trying so much to contain myself here. You're definitely insulting me. Why don't you get your facts right? How am I supposed to know why students are missing in your school? What, what answer am I supposed to give to you? You don't know me. You just wait. You like wrong. You may run, but you can not hide. I will trace you out. That's all I have for you. Thank you, Sam. I'm worried. What is it? How 
can Judith be involved in such an act? What has Judith done again? What has she done this time? You talk as if you are not in this school again. The Nazi us as blood suckers. All because of her attitude. Wait, uh, who and who is referring to us as blood suckers? Teacher Mary and other fellow, the one that has Afro, you should know her and her I was on my way to class the other day, they stopped me and was asking me all sorts of rubbish. You need to see the question. How come we don't know about Judith and her attitude? Blah, 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 do they expect us to know uh, everything about Judith as if we all attended the same school? Same reply I gave to them. I told them we only met here as coppers. We don't know each other before. Well, um, Zaki, honestly speaking, I these things are getting out of hand. They are really, really getting out of hand. So what do we do about it? What are you going to do when the principal of the school is doing nothing about it? We'll do nothing. Wait for him to take action. No, no, he better do something though. Okay. He better do something fast because one person cannot just spoil the innocent name of others just like that it's not possible now see there is nothing i dislike on this earth than character information i hear someone just accusing me first i don't like it exactly that is a thing i dislike as well i dislike it so much but um, we just hope that um the principal does something drastic to rectify all these things that are happening in this school because as for me my hands are tied because I'm, I'm only a cop in this school. Same here. Huh? Same here. I can't do anything. Okay. So how is your class going? My dear, don't mind those students. The, the kids are something. As it is, some of them, they are very funny. The assignment I gave them, they are not yet done with it. What do you expect me to do now? Oh my God. I don't know what is really happening in this school. What do you know? What's happening? So you've not heard. That students are turning into animals in this school. Turning into animals? No, Is that actually, a joke or what? Eh? You call that a joke? It's not a joke, but the truth. That is what is happening. How come I don't know about this? Mm. It's because we are not in the school yesterday. This is unbelievable. Mm. Honestly, me, me, I'm scared of what is happening in this school. I'm thinking of resigning. I want to resign. The same thing I'm thinking now. Okay, it's only God that will help us. My dear, I want to resign because I'm afraid. Things are happening. Things are happening. I'm I'm I don't want to die. You. I my don't dear, want to die. Bye -bye. My students are waiting for me. Students, you are still teaching? Yes. My good afternoon. I was actually coming from the principal's office, but he's not around. Yeah, he went out. Okay. Uh, there is something I want to discuss with you, Michael. Don't mind. What is it about? It's about the happiness in this school. I think it's time for us to seek for solution. Hmm. Do you have any idea of what we can do? Yes, ma'am. I will take people to my village to see a very powerful native daughter. He can help us. Really? Yes, ma'am. If I may ask, where are you from? I'm from Ozozo, in Echie. It's a very popular place, you should know it. I've heard of that name before. I'll discuss with the principal when he gets back. Then I'll give you the feedback. Thank you for your No problem.
to this school, I rated you as the best copper teacher. Even when people were telling me stories about you, I found it difficult to believe because I kept being on your side. But because I said I was going to get to the bottom of it, today I have gotten there. I, I happen to tell you, the only thing I know that you are going to pay and pay dearly for all the blood you have spilled in this school. Yes, sir. Yes. You're yeah, sorry. 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 Sorry.